All right, next round. Let's see. Renat Jumabayev. You know what? I've been playing Knight F3, E4. I typically don't play the London and, and Rapid. But I, I think it's time. I think it's time. Let's just... Let's just play some London, you know? Maybe it's a little bit of a... A little bit of a happy place. Okay, this line, B6... Okay, bishop e7. Yeah, it should be it should be. I'm gonna play queen e2 early, just because bishop a6 can be a can be a thought in some of these positions. And actually, let's continue c3. Knight d5, knight b4. I don't know. I don't know if it's there. Oh, he really wants the trade. Wow. He wants it that badly. think that's okay could play c4 and i actually kind of like c4 here now we switch to more of a queen's gambit structure where i feel like that bishop on a6 is slightly misplaced i mean i guess it's not terrible Ooh, the temptation of rook c1. Yeah, even if I get an isolated pawn, ah, that looks good. Take knight, knight takes. It looks really promising. The other option is I play b3. No, I, I, my, I, I my gut says this. Really, he's going to speed with knight c6. Relying on, if I take, probably knight takes somewhere. I think is what he's relying on. I just want to play bishop g5. Because there's starting to be some lines where taking there is real good. Or it's just not getting attacked after I take. Hmm. A5? Just accept it, but I have more active pieces all around. It's all pretty tempting. I, I feel like I, I really can just keep this bishop and go for this position. And I, I think I'm, I'm going to be pretty happy here. Love to sack. Show, baby, turn it up. Make it work. One more time. You know how it goes, baby. Shake your hips. Drop it low. Move around. Let your skin show. Oh, this is intense. This is intense. Okay. Check. Idea was D5. With D6 to follow, taking the square away from the king and hitting this rook. Queen B4 really just going after this pawn with also some discovery ideas is kind of what I'm looking for. Give my king some space.
That was a freaking intense game. Oh my goodness. Uh.